there anything I can help you with? I heard what happened to Robin. Soups lose heart. The Daily Mail. You see, when they're apart, they're absolute fucking rubbish. Cars. The point is, we need each other. We're fucking thin the woman. The Boys is a popular American television series that has gained a lot of attention for its dark and gritty take on the superhero genre. But what do we know about the actors who bring these characters to life? In this video, we'll be taking a look into the private lives of some of the boys' main cast members, their relationships, interests, and more. So sit back, relax, and let's dive into the personal lives of the boys' cast. If you want to stay up to date with more exclusive content and behind-the-scenes insights, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. 1. Carl Urban, Billy Butcher Let's start with Carl Urban, born on June 7, 1972, in Wellington, New Zealand, rose to fame through his roles in TV shows like Hercules and Xena. However, it was his portrayal of Aemir in the Lord of the Rings trilogy that gained him international recognition. Urban's career continued to flourish as he played Leonard Bones McCoy in the Star Trek reboot series, showcasing his humor and acting range. So I have a little miss. In 2019, he took on the role of Billy Butcher in Amazon Prime's The Boys, solidifying his status as a fan favorite with his intense performance and cutting one-liners. Outside of acting, Urban is involved with charities like Kids Can and was named a UNICEF ambassador for New Zealand. He enjoys outdoor activities such as fishing and surfing. With his talent and versatility, Carl Urban has left a lasting impact on the world of film and television. 2. Jack Henry Quaid, Huey Campbell Better. You're joking. Jack Henry Quaid was born on April 24, 1992, in Los Angeles, California. He is the son of famous actors Dennis Quaid and Meg Ryan. Growing up, Jack experienced his parents' separation at a young age, which had a significant impact on him. Despite this, he was raised in a family of actors and was exposed to the entertainment industry from a young age. Jack made his debut in the film industry with a role in The Hunger Games in 2012, where he played the character Marvel. He continued to appear in various films, including mm -hmm. Sorry, I need to see some ID. Kill for Like and Lucky Logan, but it was his role in The Boys that gained him widespread recognition. In The Boys, Jack plays the character Hugh Campbell, one of the members of the group fighting against corrupt superheroes. In addition to his acting career, Jack has also tried his hand at voice acting. He has lent his voice to the comedy cartoon, Harvey Girls Forever, and will be featured in the upcoming Star Trek web series, Lower Decks. This is my place. We am uh, opening a Fogo de Chance. Despite his growing fame, Jack keeps his personal life relatively private. He has been in a relationship with actress Lizzie Magruder since 2015, and fans speculate that a wedding may be on the horizon. With his talent and promising career, Jack Quaid is undoubtedly an actor to watch out for in the future. 3. Anthony Starr, Homelander It's making us look ridiculous. Anthony Starr, a 45-year-old actor from New Zealand, gained international recognition for his portrayal of the psychopathic villain Homelander in the hit anti-superhero series, The Boys on Amazon Prime. Star has played the menacing character in the first three seasons of the show and is set to reprise the role in the fourth season. His performance as Homelander has made him a fan favorite, with many suggesting he should receive an Emmy nomination. Aside from the boys, Star has an impressive list of credits to his name. He has appeared in the New Zealand comedy crime series Outrageous Fortune, playing the dual role of twins Jethro and Van West. He also played the lead role of Lucas Hood in the American action series Banshee and Garrett Hawthorne in the mystery series American Gothic. The American people, they know. They know when someone's telling the facts and they know when the media is lying to them. However, Starr faced negative media attention when he was arrested in Spain a few weeks before the release of the third season of The Boys. He was arrested in Alicante, Spain, after assaulting a 21-year-old chef at a pub while drunk. Star punched the chef, causing him to be hospitalized and receive four stitches. He received a 12-month suspended prison sentence for the crime of wounding and had to pay £4,400 in restitution to avoid jail. 4. Aaron Moriarty, Starlight Aaron Moriarty is a talented and ambitious actress who has made a name for herself in the entertainment industry. 
appreciate the effort. Born in New York on June 24, 1994, Erin always had a rebellious spirit and a passion for the arts. She discovered her love for acting in high school, and at the age of 17, she landed her first role. Erin's career took off when she appeared in popular TV series such as One Life to Live and Law & Order, Special Victims Unit. She caught the attention of critics and viewers alike, and soon after, she landed a role in the fantasy comedy TV series The Watch, alongside Vince Vaughn and Ben Stiller. In the following years, Erin continued to impress with her performances in projects like Red Widow, The Kings of Summer, and True Detective. She received critical acclaim and was recognized as one of the top young actresses in the industry. But it was her role as Starlight in the superhero TV series The Boys that truly catapulted Erin to stardom. Her portrayal of a young superhero navigating the corrupt and violent world of superheroes received widespread praise from viewers and critics. The show became a sensation, and Erin's talent and charisma shone through. 5. Dominique McElligot, Queen Maeve And I... Dominique McElligot is a talented actress known for her role as Queen Maeve in the hit superhero series, The Boys. Born in Rathfarnham, Ireland, McElligot developed an interest in acting after being inspired by Daniel Day-Lewis' performance in the movie, My Left Foot. She began acting in secondary school and went on to study at University College Dublin. McElligot's first major role was playing Cora Collins in the Irish sports drama series, On Home Ground. Although the show received mixed reviews, it marked the beginning of her acting career. In 2008, McElligot started getting regular roles in both film and television. She appeared in shows like, Raw, and movies like, Leap Year, and, The Guard. Her breakthrough role came in 2011 when she played Lily Bell in the AMC Western series, Hell on Wheels. The show depicted the construction of the first transcontinental railroad and McElligot's character was a strong-willed English woman who became a surveyor. After her time on, Hell on Wheels, McElligot went on to book main roles in three more dramas, including, The Astronaut Wives Club, The Last Tycoon, and, House of Cards. Really milking this thing for all it's worth. But it was her role as Queen Maeve in, The Boys, that truly solidified McElligot's status as a rising star. As Queen Maeve, she portrays a disillusioned superhero whose hopes of saving the world are crushed by the corruption of her fellow heroes. Despite her past roles, McElligot's portrayal of Queen Maeve showcases her versatility as an actress. 6. Jesse T. Usher, A Train When you were talking about how much you hated your job, you meant... Jesse T. Usher is best known for his role as a train, the fastest member of the seven, in the hit Amazon Prime series, The Boys. Despite his character's heinous acts in season one, Usher managed to make a train more likable in the show's second season. In real life, Usher is extremely likable and charismatic, which has earned him roles in films such as Shaft and Almost Christmas. He is also a talented actor, having studied culinary arts in college and falling in love with baking. He even hopes to become a restaurateur in addition to his acting career. Although Usher played a basketball player in the show Survivor's Remorse, he admits he lacks skill on the court. However, his role in the series earned him recognition among actual NBA stars, including Brooklyn Nets point guard James Harden, who was starstruck by him in a Las Vegas hotel lobby. Great, we're fucked. No, it, it was really nice to talk to someone who didn't know who I was. Usher had the opportunity to meet his lifelong idol, Will Smith, at the 2016 White House Correspondents' Dinner. He had previously portrayed Smith's on-screen stepson in Independence Day, Resurgence, a role that Usher cherished due to his admiration for Smith's work on The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. In 2018, Usher launched his own production company, Mansa Productions, with his business partner Kellen Akeem. The company released its first project, a dramatic short film called A Father's Love, which Usher co-wrote and had his Survivor's Remorse co-star Ron Rico Lee direct. Usher's first day on the boys' set was challenging, as he had to shoot a scene involving the gruesome death of a character. He spent hours covered in blood, but he embraced the intensity of the show and the shocking moments it delivers. Outside of acting, Usher's sister, Jestia, is a successful fashion designer. She has crafted garments for her brother's red carpet premieres and even made him a face mask honoring Chadwick Boseman's Black Panther. 7. Chase Crawford, The Deep Yes, Dolphins Ahoy Extravaganza, starring Christopher Chase Crawford, known as Chase Crawford, rose to prominence with his role as The Deep in the popular series, The Boys. 
Born and raised in Texas, Chase initially pursued modeling and attended Pepperdine University. However, it was his mother's encouragement that led him to pursue acting. Chase's portrayal of The Deep in The Boys showcases his versatility as an actor. The Deep is a complex character who initially appears as a typical arrogant superhero, but as the series progresses, Chase brings depth and vulnerability to the role. The character's journey mirrors Chase's own career trajectory, as he navigated the challenging world of acting. The Deep struggles with personal demons and insecurities, which resonates with Chase's own experiences in Hollywood. Despite his striking looks and early success, Chase faced challenges and had to work hard to establish himself as a serious actor. Chase's portrayal of The Deep in The Boys has been praised for its nuanced performance, highlighting his ability to bring depth and complexity to the character. The role showcases his growth as an actor and solidifies his place in the industry. Chase's journey from a small town in Texas to becoming a key player in The Boys serves as an inspiration to aspiring actors, showing that hard work, dedication, and a willingness to take on challenging roles can lead to success in the fiercely competitive world of entertainment. 8. Nathan Mitchell, Black Noir <coughs> Mr. Butcher Nathan Mitchell's portrayal of the character Black Noir in the hit series, The Boys, has solidified his status as a versatile and captivating actor. As Black Noir, Nathan brings a brooding intensity and physicality to the screen, captivating audiences with his enigmatic presence. Black Noir is a member of the elite superhero team known as The Seven, a group that is worshipped by the public but harbors dark secrets behind their polished public image. With his sleek black suit, mask, and lethal combat skills, Black Noir exudes an air of mystery and danger. Nathan's performance as Black Noir showcases his dedication to his craft and his ability to bring complex characters to life. Through his nuanced portrayal, he captures the internal conflict and emotional depth that lies beneath Black Noir's stoic facade. Whether he is engaged in high-octane fight scenes or conveying subtle emotions through his physicality, Nathan's portrayal leaves a lasting impact on viewers. The role of Black Noir allows Nathan to further showcase his martial arts prowess, as the character relies heavily on hand-to-hand -hand combat skills. His background as a former national sparring champion shines through in the meticulously choreographed fight sequences, adding an extra layer of authenticity to his performance. Nathan Mitchell's portrayal of Black Noir in The Boys has garnered critical acclaim and has endeared him to fans worldwide. Through his talent, dedication, and ability to delve into the complexities of his character, Nathan continues to make an indelible mark in the world of television and showcase his undeniable range as an actor. 9. Aya Cash, Stormfront. Hey, this this day and age, but in the boys, Aya Cash portrays the complex character of Stormfront. Stormfront is a newcomer to the Seven, a group of super-powered individuals who are idolized by society. With her charming smile and charismatic personality, she quickly becomes a fan favorite. Cash's portrayal of Stormfront is captivating and multidimensional. She brings a fresh energy to the show with her fearless and outspoken character. Stormfront is a social media savvy superhero who uses her powers to manipulate public opinion and push her own agenda. Despite her seemingly noble intentions, it becomes clear that she has a dark and twisted side. Cash's performance as Stormfront is praised for its intensity and nuance. She effortlessly balances the character's charming persona with her sinister motives, leaving viewers on the edge of their seats. Cash's ability to bring depth and complexity to Stormfront's character adds an extra layer of intrigue to the already gripping storyline of the boys. Off-screen, Aya Cash has had an impressive career in the entertainment industry. She has appeared in various popular television shows and films, including You're the Worst, The Wolf of Wall Street, and The Newsroom. Despite facing financial struggles early on in her career, Cash's dedication and talent have propelled her to success. 10. Jensen Ross Ackles, Soldier Boy. Drinks. In The Boys, Jensen Ross Ackles takes on the role of Soldier Boy, a character with a rich and intriguing backstory. Soldier Boy is a legendary superhero, known for his involvement in World War II. With his impressive combat skills and unwavering patriotism, he quickly became a symbol of hope and inspiration for the American people. However, as the series delves deeper into the world of superheroes, it becomes apparent that Soldier Boy's heroic image may not be all that it seems. 
Ackles brilliantly portrays the complexities of this character, highlighting the internal struggles that Soldier Boy faces. Despite his heroic reputation, Soldier Boy is plagued by insecurities and a deep sense of loneliness. Ackles brings depth and vulnerability to the role, allowing viewers to empathize with the character's inner turmoil. As the series progresses, we witness Soldier Boy's journey of self-discovery and redemption, as he grapples with the consequences of his past actions. Ackles' portrayal of Soldier Boy is a departure from his iconic role as Dean Winchester in Supernatural. The actor seamlessly transitions into this new character, showcasing his versatility and range as an actor. Fans of Ackles will undoubtedly be captivated by his compelling performance in The Boys, eagerly awaiting the revelations and character development that lie ahead. The actors of The Boys have captivated fans around the world with their mesmerizing performances and larger-than-life characters. From Chase Crawford to Nathan Mitchell, Aya Cash to Jensen Ross Ackles, these talented performers bring depth and complexity to the screen with each passing episode. Behind the scenes, these stars have success stories of their own. From humble beginnings to achieving great heights in Hollywood, these actors have proven that hard work and dedication can lead to success. We look forward to seeing what the future holds for them. So there you have it. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe for more entertaining content. Until next time.